Hey YouTube, welcome, welcome back to my channel. I'm Daisha Nicole. If you're new here, and as you can tell by today's title, we're doing another simple glam. This is more of a springtime lilac Easter inspired type of look. I just honestly went in and just did whatever. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video and like it. And once again, if you haven't already, please hit that like, comment, subscribe button, and let's jump into the video. Okay, hey y'all. So I'm going in with my Beauty Bay Rich Palette, and starting off, I'll be going in that Rich Palette with the shade Brioche, I believe. It's a natural brown natural tan closer to my skin complexion and then just a few i'll be going in with the same palette in the same shade of a uh, celo celo i don't know how you pronounce it but i'll be going in with that shade and then i'll be mixing that shade along with the chocolate shade in the same palette just to give a little more depth within my crease area and then with just a few i'll be going in with my juvia's place concealer in the shade 12 is it 12 Either way, it'll be listed down in the description box down below, but I'll be going in with that shade to pretty much just, not necessarily cut my crease, but to just brighten it up. That way I can put in my lilac purple lavender type of shade, but y'all see just in a few. I just wanted to give y'all a little introduction and kind of what's going on and... Okay, so now I'll be going into my Berry Palette by Beauty Bay. So starting off, I actually went in, in this palette, the color Shake. It's like a really, really light, pinky, purple, lilac type of color. So I started off with that, and then on top of that, I went in with Oyster and placed that on top. And then just a few, I'll be going in with this, like, metallic, pinky, purple type of shade called Cloud in the same palette. And pretty much that will literally conclude my eyeshadow look like. Y'all, when I tell y'all this was so simple, it was so simple. So now I'm going in with my e.l.f. liquid expert eyeliner. I believe that's what it's called. But I'll be going in with my eyeliner and just making my little eyeliner to my perfection. And then just a few. Um, we'll be starting into my skincare, skin prep to finish off my face. <laughs> Okay, so now that my skin prep is complete, I'll be actually going in two foundations by the brand Black Opal in the shade Hazelnut. Then I'll be going in with my NARS in the shade Macau. Honestly, I'm not necessarily mixing these on hand, but I'm mixing them in my face eventually. And I'll just be taking a damp beauty blender that I actually picked up from Shop Miss A. This is the Viral Pawpaw Beauty Blender, so it is damp. So pretty much I'm just blending out that foundation all over my face to cover any blemishes I might have and also y'all do not forget to blend out the foundation down to your neck. We want our face and neck to look like one, okay? We need to look like one. So yeah, just blend away. Then now I'm just going in with my Take Care of Beauty contouring stick, bronzing stick, whatever you want to call it. But this is actually in the shade Brown Sugar. And when I tell y'all, these literally are like perfect. Like, they just glide onto your skin so good. Then I'll also be going in with just a clean, um, slanted makeup brush. And I'll just be taking that same 
contouring bronzing stick and just placing that on the side bridges of my nose and then now I'm going in with my expert face brush from Real Techniques I believe and then I'm just blending out everywhere where I place that bronzer on my face and yeah so pretty much in just a few starting out <laughs> I'm going in with my concealer. This is actually my Juvia's Place Concealer in the shade... Is this, no, this is actually 18. This is the shade 18. This is the brightest shade, so I'll be going in with 18 and just placing this under my nose. Under my nose, what am I talking about? Under my eyes, under my nose, my chin area, down the bridge of my nose, and my forehead area. And then on the perimeter of that, I already going in with my Juvia's Place Concealer in the shade 18. Did I say 18 already? I'm at 12, y'all. I am so tired. <laughs> I'm gonna get done with this. What's over? But yeah, I'm going in with my damp beauty blender once again and just blending out that concealer. And when I tell y'all, blend and take your time. Like everything will just come together and it'll leave nothing like butter. Like so, just like this. Okay, so here I'm actually taking my Juvia's Place Bronze Bronze Palette in the shade 10 and I'm just mixing, well I clearly mix both shades together and I'm just honestly sitting everywhere where I placed that contouring bronzing stick that I showed you guys earlier by the KKL Beauty and pretty much that is literally it. Like that's so self-explanatory when it comes to bringing the structure to my face. Okay, if that makes sense. I hope I'm making sense to y'all. <laughs> So now I'm taking my one size setting powder in the shade Sweet Honey. When I tell y'all this setting powder is so good, like this is so good. So starting off first, I'm not necessarily baking. I'm actually going in to set that concealer in place. So I'm taking a light layer of that, damping it on my the palm of oil, the outer side of my hand, and then just going in with the excess powder that's left. So then now I'm going back in with that same powder. And this time I'm doing more of a baking type of method. And pretty much that concludes me baking, setting my under eye. <laughs> okay, here I'm just carving out the cheekbone area of my face I'm just trying to add a little more structure to my face you don't necessarily have to do this but I just felt like with this look in this eyeshadow this is kind of necessary in my opinion and I just like the structure of my face to be honest y'all I know it sounds cocky but yeah so now I'm going in with the KKL Beauty well first starting off first I'm going in with a clean face powder brush and I'm just actually wiping off the excess powder from that sweet honey that we said earlier so now I'm going in with my KKL Beauty Essential HD palette and I'll just be taking my preferred shade to set the under eye area and just pretty much set everywhere where I place that concealer and where I would like to set my foundation so now I'm going in with my Essence Mascara and just applying that mascara to my lower lash line and then I'll just be going in underneath my false lashes and just applying that mascara as well. And then just a few, I'll be finishing up my look with my lip combo and I'll be going back in with my one size setting powder. Setting powder. I am so tired y'all. I mean my one size setting spray. I'm so done. Jesus. So, yeah, um, I really apologize, y'all, for this 
crazy voiceover. I don't know what's going on. Maybe I'm just tired, but I just wanted to make sure I got this video edited and out to you guys in a timely manner. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I promise y'all, the next voiceover will be a thousand times better. Okay, I'm just I'm still kind of new to the voiceover thing, still trying to get used to it because it's, it's a process. It's a process, y'all. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And definitely turn on all post notifications so you never miss another upload. And be sure to follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram. And also, you guys, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Because a lot of y'all be watching my videos and y'all don't be subscribing to my channel. Or y'all be watching my videos and not commenting. Like, comment. I have to know, or at least I want to know what type of looks you guys want from me in the future. So definitely comment down below. Subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. And good night, y'all. Yeah, it's that bird in the VIP line with the V tie and the Issa run. It's a drive to Nissan, now she had a pink mind. I don't want her, cause she from the corner. And I heard that Beamer was an owner. My old man, the owner. And I don't even drink Coronas. What type of drink you want, bro? No champagne for them. No dirt strike for them. Come sip with me, if you like chain the weather If you want a little better, we can buy a grill whatever Don't get too thirsty, get used to the chatter I wanna tell the world about you just so they can get jealous And if you see a fool I do, tell I wish that I'd be Turn on the light